Hi everyone, I've got my November 2020 Scentsy Whip Box. I'm so excited to open this and see what's in it. I hope that you stick around and join me. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. To my returning viewers, my subscribers, thank you so much. Your support just means everything in the world to me. So thank you, thank you, thank you. If you are new to my channel, I hope you click on that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. And today, I'm doing my November 2020 Scentsy Whip Box. Woohoo! So anyway, I love getting the Whip Box. And if you haven't seen one of these before and you're thinking, what the heck is a Whip Box? Uh, Scentsy does like these mystery surprise boxes every month and they cost $30. Um, I get mine in my Scentsy Club, so I get mine every month. I don't have to think about ordering it. I don't have to say, oh yeah, I'm going to miss the Whip Box this month. So I get mine, I treat mine like a subscription and I get it every month and it costs $30. But you don't have to do it that way. If you do have a Scentsy Club, you can get it set up to ship every month, every other month or every third month. Or if you don't have a Scentsy Club, you can just you can go on to your Scentsy Consultants website. You can just order one whenever you want. And so that's what's great about it too. If you are not really into the scents or you, you're not like a hardcore Scentsy ah, person like me that just has to have it, you can just get it whenever you want one. And that's really great. Or if you see somebody do a YouTube um, video on the idea or something like this, and it's a box that you like that month, you might say, oh, that would make a great gift. Um, and get in touch with a Scentsy consultant. And if you wanted to order one, two, five, ten boxes, you can certainly do that. And it changes every month. Every month kind of has a theme to it. So again, the boxes all look like this. They're all nice, dirty boxes. They're reusable. But if you wanted to store your Scentsy bars right now, I'm using one of my boxes to store some handmade soaps. So anyway, they all say scent with love. They all are gonna come with this pamphlet. And it might will tell you a little bit about um, what the theme of the theme of the month is. So this looks like it's going to be holiday cheer. So we see some Christmas trees here, nice colorful ones. The back of the box might tell you a little bit about what's in here. It tells you about sharing your whip box and explains uh, what the sample wax cups are here. And inside, sometimes they have little charts or wish list or name tags and this month they got like a little do-it-yourself project, which is really, really cool if you've got little ones at home that want to be a little creative and just needs a little help. So this looks like you cut these out. You can use like glue or paste or tape and make little uh, 3D gift boxes. So that looks really cool to have your little ones be a little creative. Or if you don't have little ones and you want to be a little creative, voila, here you go. A little air packet. And it's a heavy one this month because I can see why. And so this is the inside of my whip box. So I can see this thing that is making it heavy. And this is a two pound thing of the Scentsy bath soap. And this is a scent we got not too long ago in our whip box as well. And I think they're probably doing this now again because this is kind of like one of their Christmassy scents. So it's called Winterberry Apple Tea. It is a two pound bath soap. So this has got like pink Himalayan salt. It's got Epsom salts in it. So that's great for relieving your sore, tired, aching muscles and just relaxing at the end of the day. They're loaded with rich moisturizers. So when you're in that the tub and you can just feel your skin getting hydrated and moisturized and the fragrances, they're all going to be like Scentsy fragrances. So the winterberry apple tea, I believe, is cranberry, honey, and apple. And as much as I love the Scentsy soaks and soaking in the tub, the only thing I'm really not crazy about is the color on this one. It's kind of like a purpley brown. And uh, I don't know, to me it just kind of, yeah, it just, it's just not, it's just not pretty. It should be either more purpley and less brown. But anyway, that's a little thing. But anyway, I do love the Scentsy soak, so I know I will use that. All right, next we have a Snowberry Kissed, it's a car bar. And this one you just hang up in your car. It's a little fragrance. And I've, um, I don't know if I've ever sniffed this one before. So it looks like it has a ribbon. 
and I'm hoping it's easy open. Ah, it is. Alrighty. Ooh, this one smells nice. So this one, it's uh, you can smell the cranberries that you know how cranberries sometimes can be kind of tart, and you can just kind of feel it right back there, and like balsam for kind of a woody scent. This is going to be perfect, especially if you um, have like a partner that doesn't like florally scents in his car. I bet he would love this, but it is nice for everyone. It's like a unisex fragrance. Yeah, it's like sweet cranberries, but I can feel it back here. Oh, and I love this. So we got uh, more, sam more samples of the laundry. So this one is Amazon Rain. So we've got the uh, Scentsy Soft, so the fabric softener and the liquid. And Amazon Rain, this is one of my favorites. I think this is probably one of the second scents that I bought when I started getting into Scentsy. My first love here is Luna, but Amazon Rain. So it's, um, it's a really fresh fragrance. It's like melon and some orange zest and coconut milk and jasmine. It's, but it's a light spa-like fragrance. It's really light, it's really fresh, it's inviting. So love this scent. Love to climb into my sheets after I've washed them. It's really nice. And it looks like we've got three bars this month. Alrighty, so two of them. I, I think I got last month and one of my Christmas things. So this one is actually the scent of the month, which I didn't get my little uh, sample last month. And this one, so this one is 10% um, off through the end of November. And it's a jeweled pomegranate. And back. And again, if you're not familiar with Scentsy, they come with eight cubes in here. Uh, these these bars and they're perforated kind of like right here so all you have to do is kind of like bend them it's easy for me to bend like this so it feels kind of frozen still but you just kind of kind of bend while all these cubes are separated I think I did it uh -huh. and this one does it smells nice I was wondering I didn't buy any this month but it does smell nice. So, um, so this one is, if I can get it out. So it's a pomegranate, but I smell um, something sweet. Um, kind of like an orange, but maybe spice or maybe like a mandarin orange. I'm trying to get one out. It's coming out like a house shape. And a sugar and a cinnamon. And there you go. You just take out this and you would plop it right into your warmer. And Raina, Felicity, for you. But anyway, it, it's sweet. I mean, sometimes you, you think cinnamon and you, and you think a really strong cinnamon, but it's it's a really, it's a sweet cinnamon. And, and it has to be mandarin, it's not orange. But it does smell nice. It does seem like it, it will be a nice winter fragrance. And next we have Dancing Sugar Plums. And this one I had last month that I purchased on my own. And this is so, so pretty. So this is like a, a rich, like a spice plum, vanilla, and sweet cinnamon apple. So this is really got to be a nice one too. And the last one here is called Best in Snow. And this is the one that last month that was like, ooh, this, it just kind of just reminds me of being outdoors um, after a nice, fresh snow and the air is crisp and it's cold and you got like, kind of like a cool mint and you got like the evergreens but and I think I missed it last time it's um it's on the idea to me of um like a fresh linen type scent that's um been air dried and it's in the summer so you got like a, it's like a soft soft floral in the in the air but you really pick up on that fresh uh, pine smell, the evergreens and the mint. So this is really nice. So I do love this one. And, and I did get my sample for next month, which this is going to be the scent of the month. And it's called Arctic Kiss. And I have seen some spoilers for the warmer of the month. Yeah, I'm getting that one. That one looks gorgeous. It's uh, mimicking like the Aurora Borealis. Oh my God, it is so, so pretty. But anyway, 
Last thing here to sniff for you, Arctic Kiss. Sometimes these are hard to open. I already got it. So this is on the, it's kind of, to me, it's like a cross. I mean, I just described what Amazon Rain was with like a, the melon and jasmine. And, uh, but this has a little bit of the evergreen in it too. And, and a little bit of mint, not much. And vanilla. And vanilla to kind of soften and sweeten it. So it's kind of like best in snow, but not exactly. It's lighter. It's sweeter. And I think it's the mel it's it's I'm picking up some kind of like a honeydew melon or something. But anyway, I think this is going to be a nice one. So yeah, I'm going to have to uh, order some of this uh, with my warmer of the month next month. And I'm going to go the wrong way, aren't I? Yes, I am. So anyway, yeah, Arctic Kiss. This is going to be a nice one. This one, it's 10% off through the end of November. Not this one. Jeweled Pomegranate. So this one is nice too. So this one, again, it was a pomegranate but like the sweet mandarin and cinnamon. Very, very nice. So that was my Scentsy Whip Box for the month of November. So I'm really excited about this. I got some really nice bars in here. There's bars in here to add to my collection. I love getting like, they don't do the bath bombs anymore, but I love the Scentsy soaps. I love taking baths at the end of the night and just relaxing. And yeah, so this is and two pounds. That's gonna last you a while. And I am excited that I got to sniff the one for next month because, yeah, I'll get it again. So anyway, I want to thank everyone for joining me. Um, if you don't have a Sensi Consultant and you're interested in any of this or you have any questions, you can leave it in the description below. And I'll also um, leave my daughter's, uh, Raina, her website and uh, her information just in case you had any questions. But if you have a Sensi Consultant um, or you're, you know, and sometimes too, you may be, doing Facebook parties for some of your friends or things like that. And because we're not really going to home parties anymore, you may be wondering, well, what do they smell like? What does it look like? What is that? So it's just a kind of good way to check it out and see if it's something that you want to buy. Because, you know, we've all been invited to our friends' parties and we want to get something, but we don't always know what to get. And so, yes, yeah, so I'm hoping some of my descriptions might help you with that. I'm not the best at giving the descriptions, but I always try for you. And um, anyway, so I want to thank everyone for joining me and I hope everyone goes out and has a fantastic week and we will chat again later. Bye-bye everyone.